And I have a new track from the Jonas Brothers coming up in just a second. 1027 Kiss FM, and I have the Jonas Brothers with us. By the way, let me just run down some of the things that's happening here with them. The next single is coming up here on Kiss in a minute uh, from their second album in stores now. The Look Me in the Eyes tour kicks off January 31st in Tucson. Gibson Amphitheater here February 2nd. Tickets on sale Saturday at noon. All Ticketmaster outlets. I have your tickets in just a few minutes here at Kiss FM. Now, if you want to be in the first 20 rows for the show, you can go to the actual box office there at the Gibson Amphitheater to get those tickets. Tickets, and they're set to appear in the Hannah Montana and Miley Cyrus Best of Both Worlds concert film set for 3D release on February 1st. Plus, they've just announced a, a new world tour. As if they've got nothing going yeah, on, they're sure. working on their new album simultaneously. Yikes. And we have Kevin, Joe, and Nick. Hey, guys. Hello, hey. sir. Hey. I've, I've spent more time with you in 2008 than anybody else. <laughs> I, well, a happy new year to you again. Thank you again for being in New York City there in Times Square, Ellen. We watched the ball drop together drop down. with How a million people. How special. That was amazing. It was, was, we felt like one family, didn't we? We did, but I, I didn't appreciate you guys trying to kiss me at midnight. I, that was not <laughs> what I was looking for. I, I quickly ran over to Carrie Underwood. Uh, yes, we right. We, yeah. <laughs> it, it was a good move. Hey, what can you tell me about the album that you're working on from the bus? How do you actually record an album on a bus? Yeah, we, um, we actually we were up in Canada filming uh, Camp Rock when we basically were talking to our managers and, you know, Phil, my dad, and everything, and... We were just like, we had all these new songs that we really loved to record, but we didn't really have any time to get into the mm. studio because we were like jam packed. And uh, basically, we just said, let's get a bus out on the road, bring John Fields out, our producer, and we'll record some of the new songs. And we did that, and we recorded pretty much the whole new record. Um, we have one week left in the real studio when we get back to LA. But um, other than that, you know, the, the new record sounds really cool. Um, we have a couple ideas for what the first single will be, but. Just really excited about the way it's sounding, and we'll be playing uh, some of the new songs on our new tour, which is coming up in February and January 31st. Now, when I talk on a cell phone on a bus, my voice gyrates. Like, how do you actually record a song? How, I mean, does, how does it work when you're on the road? You're moving on the bus, or are you stationary? Um, we did both. Um, we, you know, hooked up to power when we were when we were there, so we shut off the generator because you had that low hum. But, right. Um, we got a lot of times we recorded the the vocals, and because like, we usually would go into a studio afterwards, and if we needed anything, like need to be fixed, like, mm -hmm. um, say, like, a few vocals because of the rumbling of the bus or something. But we actually kept a lot of the vocals because it just sounded so cool. Huh. And the Live Nation signing looks pretty exciting. I mean, that's, a, what, a long-term worldwide touring deal? Yeah, yeah um, it's, a, you know, it's a two-year de deal for us. It's our first big touring deal. So, so not rich. only are they popular, they're rich. Yeah, there you go. Congratulations. They're, they're rich and popular and chicks love them. So it's two <laughs> years, and where will you go? Um, we're planning on everywhere, and right now we've released the first um, a bunch of dates, and of course L.A. is right there on the first list because we had to go back. We have, it's been a while, so we needed to get back to L.A., and it's been since like November. Kevin, Joe, and Nick are with us. Jonas Brothers, 1027 Kiss FM. I got their latest single coming up in just a second. Joe, how are you doing? Last week you had to go to the emergency room, I heard. Yep, I had to. Um, we were filming a YouTube video. Yeah. Um, to promote the tickets for the sale on Saturday. Right. And we do a lot of, like, funny YouTube videos. And um, and pretty much I uh, during the video I tripped and I hit my head really hard and had to get rushed to the emergency room. And, um, and I had to get some stitches, a bunch of stitches. And then, yeah, so. <laughs> well, you're a tripper, dude. You're, you've fallen a couple of yeah. times now. Yeah. Yeah, and those head cuts, they bleed it's a not, lot. Actually, you know what, it's. Ever, it's the ground. It's no, not I, you, it's the no, ground. Let me, let me, I'll tell you what it is. I'll tell you what it is. I think this is an effort for you to score oh. more chicks because now you're uh -huh. a Jonas brother and you're getting sympathy. Are you trying to stand yeah, out from I've, your I've brothers? I've played that one up a few times. I've like, texted a few girls who didn't know about it. I was like, hey, you know, I had to go to the hospital. Please keep me in your oh, prayers. You didn't, you didn't text him. I, he's like, hey, Kevin, you text him from your phone and be like, hey, Joe wants you to know that he's doing okay. Oh, but it totally works, though. This is all fair until you draw blood. That's not fair. That's like cheating. <laughs> like, like, let every girl you know. Paper cut. Because, like, they, like, they, okay, I got, like, I got presents from girls. I got, like, I got balloons. I got everything. And yeah. they were even talking about flying out to see me. So that's oh, really good. Wow. So what girls, like, that, like, I think kind of like me, so. What, what he's saying is he's going to trip a little bit later today again. <laughs> Oh, yeah. uh, I don't know if my parents can handle the heart attack. So, right. Well, let's put you on the spot again. I heard you're also dating artist JoJo. <laughs> there she is. Oh, yeah. There's our JoJo. She's cute. 
Um, no, we're just friends, um, and you can believe me on that one. Yeah, I've never um, heard that statement before. I know you have. Ryan, but, you for, know. For real? No, but for real, we're friends, and um, I think that would just be too crazy of a mashup name. Jojo, 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 right? <laughs> <laughs> so, like, Jojo, Ryan, Jojo. as you know, you take a picture with a friend, and immediately you're dating them. Belie- right. I know so well, because I'm dealing with it today. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So, it's like, the fact that it happens, it's just, boom. There you are. It's like, you know, we're going true. to dinner. We're all hanging out in Boston, and then the picture's taken, and then immediately, you know, they've been dating for nine months. You know, they're looking for a great future. It's I like, want, what are you want, talking I want to about? Know, like the inside sources. There's always that inside Dude, source. and they have the quotes. I just was flipping through a magazine that came out today, and I'm looking at this picture and reading this story that's completely made up about a relationship that allegedly I have that uh-huh. I don't have. Right. Exactly. And you do wonder, it's like, what kind of background check are they doing on this source? Yeah. But it's, it's kind of awkward if, like, you're, if you're, like, friends with the person, you know, like, close friends, and then you have to call and be like, so. Yeah, I called JoJo. I was like, so. Uh, and she's like, yeah. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> so we're not dating. She's like, no. Like, well, then, then Nick, right, is, is, it, is it safe to say that it is true that you and Miley were just friends this entire time? I'm sorry, what'd you say? <laughs> <laughs> Nick. I said, is it safe to assume then that you, Nick, and Miley had just been friends all this time? Uh, you'll never know. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. No, yeah, we were just friends. Do you know how many people asked me just... if you guys kissed at New Year's? I'm like, I don't know. I wasn't looking. I was busy hosting. Yeah, you were busy, weren't you? I don't know. I have to watch yeah, you, were, you, were, you, you, had like a, you had like 10 people like yelling at you. It was crazy. So did you kiss? <laughs> We did not. Oh. They didn't. No. Okay. They all made a move for Carrie Underwood. Everybody did. Yeah, that's Everybody what I hear. Carrie. Well, I'm looking forward to this uh, new album, guys. Let me know when we can get something to play on the air, right? Absolutely. But we got a brand new single first, though. I got it right here. I think, don't I? Uh oh. It's it's for all the ladies out there. When you look me in the <laughs> eyes. Yeah. Okay. Who inspired this one? You know, it's actually one of the older Jonas Brothers songs, like from back in the day when we were, you know, originally on the Columbia thing. Our name, our name at the beginning, this is uh, Ryan Seacrest exclusive. Ryan Seacrest exclusive right here. It was Sons of Jonas. Sons of Jonas. Sons it of was, Jonas. Then it was Jonas 3. Then No, they, then they thought about doing Jonas Cubed. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> then and then Jonas, <laughs> Jonas, Jonas. Uh-huh. And then we actually went on stage and we told, oh, there was Jonas Run, Run, Jonas Run. You like that one, R- Ryan? Run, Jonas Run. Run, Jonas Run. <laughs> too alarming. Then, Jonas Ridge. But that sounded too country. Well, we, Run, Jonas Run's too dangerous. <laughs> yeah. They came to the name of Jonas 3. And, and we, we were like, uh-uh. So no. the first concert we ever did, I actually went on stage. me, Joe. I actually went on stage and I just, like... We we knew that like Jonas Brothers could be like we I guess cool you know rather than Jonas Three than or anything like that, and so I just went on stage and was like hey we're the, we're the Jonas Brothers and they already had like all these like T-shirts made up that said Jonas <laughs> Three on them and stuff. So well here's the single I'm gonna play it right now. You guys get back to work. Thanks for checking in. I right? you Thanks, man. thank you so much. We'll see you on tour. You got it. Take care. Bye. Here it is. When you look me in the eyes. One zero two seven. Kiss F.